for the past couple of years, Ladies Who Lunch has been making an indelible mark on the profile of Ottawa, doing good works, mm -hmm. having fabulous lunches, of course. And now they are heading into another one on October 6th, that's this Thursday, called Maple Leaves and Honeybees. That's right. Yes, and here that to tell us fabulous. all about it is the fabulous herself, Cindy Harrison. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Thanks for having me. Oh. I wanted to stand between you guys so I could be a rose between two Julies, but... You Aww. know, it's, it's tough. It's you tough know. to get in here. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it is. It is. So, so, ladies through lunch, tell us what this one... It's a special one too, right? Because you've got a very special guest. It is a special one. So the way that the Maple Leaves and Honeybees tea came about was Eli's Cheesecake has been a sponsor of the July 4th party at the residence of the U.S. Ambassador to Canada. So anyone that's been to that party has had an opportunity to sample these amazing cheesecakes. And it's really well known that the U.S. Ambassador to Canada, Ambassador Bruce Heyman and his wife Vicky, are huge champions of Canada. Mm -hmm. They celebrate the partnership between our two countries. It's really just a lovely relationship. So when the creators, the owners of Eli's Cheesecake, Maureen and Mark Schulman, were contemplating doing the release of their Eli's Cheesecake cookbook, they said, absolutely, we're going to do it in Ottawa. Thank oh, you. that's great. Right. And so it made a lot of sense for them to um, come here because they love Ottawa and they love the partnership between the two countries and their cheesecake, is, their cheesecake cookbook is being uh, launched as well. So they chose this site as that's the uh, launch for the cookbook. And of oh course, Vicki is everywhere. I mean, I think people know <laughs> Vicki Heyman more than her husband, who's <laughs> obviously doing a job and all that sort of thing. Yeah. But Vicki has been... A uh, huge supporter of so many charities and lending her face and her name to a number of things. Mm -hmm. And when they leave in November, it's going to leave a huge hole. Yeah. And because they have really become, you know, our friends. Absolutely. In a huge way. Absolutely. And when we were looking at um, doing this, we thought we really like it to have some kind of charitable focus. Mm -hmm. sure. So we thought Thanksgiving, when people come to the table to celebrate with family and friends, what better way to, to celebrate than to um, ask the Ottawa Food Bank to partner to be the recipient of 100% of the proceeds of the silent auction. So we're thrilled wow. to help them put food on tables where people perhaps wouldn't have much of a Thanksgiving otherwise. So right. the event is on October 6th and it is the Ladies Who Lunch venue and you do still have a few tickets left? We do. So the okay. venue is at the iconic and beautiful uh, Fairmont Shadow Laurier. Perfect. It's on Thursday, October 6th from 1 to 3. There are still tickets available. So if people, probably the easiest thing to do would be to Google mm -hmm. Maple Leaves and Honeybees Tea and it will pop up with a link to the tickets. And, right. Uh, right. we hope to see everyone there. Right. Wow. That's great. So you have brought some of uh, Eli's finest cheesecakes yes. out of Chicago. Yes. Um, what, are we, what are we looking at? Okay. What are we eating with our eyes currently? <laughs> yes. I feel, I feel fat all right. I know. I'm just keeping it's, her back. Just it's for very, a very, very difficult. Did you notice me licking my fingers yeah. a little bit? So we have here the salted caramel cheesecake. Yeah. This so is there. to yeah, die just for. Stop. Delicious. Just, that's good enough right yeah. there. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. And what I've done is just taken a little bit of caramel sauce and put it on the plates. We've got some candied walnuts. I'm going to uh, let you guys design your own cheesecake. And that's what's beautiful about the Eli's cheesecakes. They come individually packaged in individual slices. Okay. So, oh, that's good. Yeah. So you can really almost do like a cheesecake bar. Mm -hmm. So I've got some um, almonds here. I have some candied walnuts that I just candied last Last night in my kitchen, um, whipped cream, maple syrup, you can really make it your own. So your guests, if somebody's not crazy about nuts, then they can put maple sugar on top, they can put ice cream on top, whatever they like. I love yeah. the, the individual slices thing because that would stop. <laughs> I'm not saying anybody in my house in particular, I'm not naming names, no. but somebody might be one of those people who takes a little sliver <laughs> off the cake mm. and then a little while later takes mm -hmm. another little sliver and before oh. too long there's not very much cake left and right. no one actually had a piece of cake. Oh. Well, you know, if you Joe. cut it many <laughs> times, the calories escape. So yes, that's a good true. plan. <laughs> I, maybe I just eat it so quickly and then I don't yeah. even have to think about it. Exactly. Well, another way to do it. All right, so what are we doing here? Yeah, we're this one it. is mm -hmm. a pumpkin pie cheesecake. Perfect. So it's lovely for the holidays. Mm -hmm. So I've just pulled some maple syrup on the plates and you can basically pick what you'd like. I have some maple syrup here, some whipped cream. 
I had to do it in the can so we didn't have to fuss, but it is real whipped cream. Yes. And is, yeah. uh, so ca some caramel sauce, candied walnuts, oh, so you can go ahead and decorate your own I'm going to decorate. Which one would you like? I'll do, you go over there. Okay, okay. Now, now tell me uh, who else is, is going to be uh, guests at the Ladies Who Lunch? Sure. We have a number of um, guests that are, are coming and we're thrilled to have them. Vicki Heyman will be there. Kelly Dunlap, the Saucy Milner. Oh, who, that's um, great. Has a I'm very making a little pile. A little <laughs> oh, I was doing a pile too. <laughs> She's not that works out well. <laughs> you can't do that anything. Well. You're just doing the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> and at the tea, we have, um, we'll have a lovely silent auction that's quite exclusive. We have a beautiful Hermes scarf, a lovely oh, handmade wonderful. crystal honey jar. Um, oh, that's all great. I, I'm sorry, keep going. I, I just got excited about that because I feel like now that people are kind of getting a little cozy inside, you're starting to think of the seasons mm -hmm. that are coming and the time of giving. It's always nice to get one of those things yes. for a hostess gift for the upcoming holidays. Make and, it a new yeah. cheese Well, and one yeah. of the exciting things that yeah. we have, very good job, Julie. Go. Yes. One of the exciting things that we have is a floral arrangement that has been curated and designed by Michelle Vandenbosch of oh, Rebel Petal. So you can actually fantastic. lift, isn't she though? You yeah. can actually Actually, take that. The, the lucky winner can pot, put that right on their Thanksgiving table. Right on table. their Thanksgiving table. You well, guys, listen, thank yeah. you so much, Cindy, for uh, coming and bringing us cheesecake. We always appreciate that. And you guys always think of everything. So good luck with the event. Thank All funds you. going to the Ottawa Food Bank. You've yep. got to get that cookbook. It'll be on the shelves if you don't get a chance mm -hmm. to get there.